Hi everybody, it's Gloria from Scraptabulous Studio and I'm coming in with my very first video tutorial today. Um, hopefully this goes really well and this is a format that I can use to show you how to make stuff in the future because 30 pictures and a short novel just isn't cutting it for a blog post. So um, today I'm using the Close to My Heart Foundry Binder Clips. Um, the number for this one is Z1711, and they're really cute and fabulous, but they're super dimensional. As you can see, this would be really hard to stick on a scrapbook page. I had a customer ask me about it, and I said, no, I'd probably just use it on 3D and cards. But I was thinking about it because, of course, she got me thinking, and late last night I had a perfect idea for it, so I grabbed my husband's multi-tool, and it worked, so I'm here today to share it with you. So what you're going to do is take your binder clip, and hold it pretty secure here like this so that that spring in there doesn't fly when you pop the pin out. And you're going to just grab the pin with your pliers or what have you, twist a little bit and pull. And it comes out pretty easy. I was really happy about that. Very exciting. And then when you take it apart, watch, you'll have that little spring there. And you're going to get rid of these pieces because um, you're not really going to use them. And this metal is fairly soft which I was so happy to find because you don't want to scrape the finish on here with your uh, multi-tool or pliers. So I just actually am able to bend it over with my fingers, um, which was great. I was so happy to find that out. So I just bent it over and then look how flat that is. You can put that right on the scrapbook page. I was so happy. So um, using this, and it's going to look just like a binder clip, um, except without the whole dimensional part. Love my swap out. Um, I wrapped some gray wool twine around it, which just dressed it up a little bit. And then what I'm going to do with mine is I have this journaling tag that I'm making that's going to be hidden journaling on my new um, page packs layout for this coming month. And um, I'm using the cruise and paper pack. And so I put my paper together and I've got my ribbon and my stuff kind of ready to go. Sorry if I'm rushing here. I only have three and a half minutes on my camera today. So I'm trying to get this all done so you can see it all together um, before I run out of time. So let me tie that up. And of course that twine is just in the wrong spot. Isn't that how it goes? Whenever you want it somewhere, it always goes the wrong way. Okay, so I just tied a knot, and um, actually that ribbon that I'm using, that black grow grain, is no longer available through the regular book through Close to My Heart. Um, but I do believe that I may have seen it on the Well Supplies last section of my shopping site the other day, which is great. You can get to the everything you can get to, all the links from my blog which is www.scraptabulousstudio.com. And let me go ahead and just grab a, this is my binder clip on my tag. And I'm just gonna put a larger glue dot on the back here. Love me some glue dots. Put it up there and you've got an instant pull up. 